Good morning. Morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. What's going hey, on? hey, third time we're filming this. Yeah. Camera's fouled down, it almost broke. That's um, right. So you're going to see me push on the camera every once in a while to make sure it's still up here. But it's there. And then we didn't hit record, which. <laughs> That's weird. But we're here now, right. and we're driving right. a 2021 Palisade, and it's super cool, actually. For it's once, nice. we're not driving a Lexus. Very no, you can't, You definitely. actually can't get this car at Hyundai. It's hard to get, and we actually have one. So, we do. So this is a, a good opportunity for you to, to buy something at Lexus that's mm -hmm. not a Lexus, which we do offer that all day. We have a whole bunch of really cool pre-owned cars. Um, but let's get to the topic today because we've already talked about this a million times. And yeah, and we already know what our goals are, but uh, we did get coffee, so now we're ready to go. Um, my goals, um, actually, my subject today was goals and did we achieve them, what we're going to do next year. My goal this year was to just become a better me and work on myself, work harder at my job, um, you know, focus on my good friends, family, things like that, and I think that it really helped me a lot. But what I didn't do enough was travel like everybody else. So hopefully next year I can travel more. Amanda's actually scheduled like two or three trips, but she's either canceled or rescheduled. Yep. Or... But I'm going. That's for sure. For me, goals are super important. At, at my age, I'm a little older these days. I'm 42. And I like to hold myself accountable every year to doing new things or trying harder or just being better at what I am doing. So I goal myself every year. And Amanda brought this topic up to me yesterday and I thought... I better check my goals, right? Because I had forgot about them for a couple months. Yeah. Right? You start getting in the rut, and I realized I'm, I'm backing off my goals just a little bit. So it was awesome to have a, a friend that could help me accountable to my goals, and everyone should have that. For sure. But I checked in on my goals, and about halfway through the year, I have a financial goal, friendship goal, relationship, health, all that good stuff. But I made me check back in and say, hey, where am I at with this? And I can put my foot on the gas. So, like, for one of my goals, um, was to have 5,000 followers on my Instagram page because that's what we do for a living here is yep. social media. Yep. Um, so I'm at 4,000, right? So if anyone's not following me, please do that. <laughs> I appreciate it. Um, but uh, definitely write down your goals. Definitely look at them all the time and have a friend hold you accountable to what you want to do in your life because goals are about doing the little things every single day. It's true. Right? Not the big things. You could say you want to do big things, but if you don't check in on them every day or all the time, you can't yeah. accomplish them. Yeah. That's a quote. Yeah. Uh, for me, I love this topic, by the way. Um, I made a vision board at the beginning of this year. There's a lot of different, you know, segments in life as far as, you know, Dominic brought up um, relationships, you know, financial goals, this and that. So I always try to revise my goals um, if there's a, you know, better route to achieve them. But I did hit a few, so that's always good. That's good. Yeah. But, you know, it's a daily process, so... Striving to get better each and every day. We're not doing it again, so this is the uh, <laughs> third time, and that's that. Bryce, I know you got a couple goals. Um, my goal this year was really uh, focusing on work. Um, like you said, during the pandemic, some of us uh, we were out. Um, we did come back. I did start sales again. Um, like I said, this is my second time around. First time was really bumpy, but this time I think um, I'm locked in, focused. Yes. And it's doing a great job. A whole lot better yes. than last time. We can all tell so, you, Bryce, you're, you're achieving your goal of being a great salesperson at Lexus Las you. Vegas. Yeah, that's what we all hope you. to be. Yeah. So, yeah, that was one of my goals. And like you said, I'm not done with everything, but just a daily process. Cool. Love the grind. Every well, day. Well, in the car business, we have goals every day. We, we uh, have to sell a certain amount of cars and all that stuff, but we can't do it without you. And overall, I think Bryce showed you last week, the overall number one goal is to provide excellent customer service that we're passionate Every about. Day. And we can't do that without you. So help us achieve our goal of providing great customer service and having fun throughout our day. Yeah, come, come in, down visit today. us, test drive, see if there's something you like, because we got cars. Yep. Well, we're back here and we're ready to start the day. Guys, any messages? Hope you all have a blessed day. What are your goals? Leave them in the comment section below. There great you go. Idea. What are your goals? Love it. If your goal is to get a new car, we got you. <laughs> we'll see you soon, Thanks. okay? See you Bye. Soon. Bye.